Welcome my fellas once again to Tuesday afternoon auction preview. Tomorrow's auction, Wednesday the 15th of June 2022 at 10am. Another massive auction for you this week. We've got 869 lots to get through tomorrow, so let's go for a bit of a tour and check it all out. All right, starting uh, over here in the middle of the yard here, we've had a uh, heap of decking come in this morning. Quite a few packs there of the uh, 135 by 19 uh, in this week in the spot of gum. We've both got a finger jointed uh, version and also just the normal stuff there as well. So a bit of 135 19, also 86 by 19 there as well. Here's a finger jointed pack, 86 by 19, set length 5.7s. How good is that? 5.7 long deck there, guys. Probably be a little bit more expensive, I reckon, than the normal stuff. But um, gee whiz, to have the uh, good long links, that's a, a bit of a bonus there. All right, so plenty of decking there, as you can see. Got more inside as well. All right, got uh, some more framing pine over there. Uh, there. Over there, we've got some 90 by 45 and 90 by 35 uh, F5. Nice big uh, solid packs there. 4.8 uh, lengths there. Really nice looking stock. Uh, over here, we've got a number of pellets. Uh, of stack stone, a few different uh, designs there. Also got some pallets of tiles in amongst here as well. It's a nice 600 by 600, as I can see there. Some 300 by 600s there as well. Gee, some of this uh, stack stone, some pretty pretty decent looking stuff here. Really, really nice stuff. Uh, heaps of treated pines also arrived in this week. Uh, I can see some nice long length 90 by 45. There's 5.4s there. I can see also some 6 metres. Uh, I've got some 190 by 45, 6 metres there as well. Also some 5.4s. Uh, on the end of the row here, guys, we've got some cypress pine posts which uh, just arrived in this morning. Uh, you'll find them in your catalogue from lot 143 through to lot number 147. All right. Keep making our way along. Had lots of uh, flooring coming this week as well, which you'll see as we go through the, the shed. Also had all this framing pine over here come in this morning also. Uh, over there, some 90 by 45 studs, 2.4s, half a dozen packs of those uh, toward the back of the row. And if we make our way over this way here, uh, 1945, we've got 5.4s, one, two, three packs of 5.4s. We've got uh, a couple packs of 6 metres there as well. Pack of 3.6s, we've got some 4.2s uh, there, and we've also got four packs of 3 metres, so we've got a good variety of lengths there. Uh, also got some 140, 45 treated pine, a couple packs of 5.4s in, uh, in the mix there as well. So, yeah, good, uh, good mixture there. Alright, making our way over here now, as you can see, lots more treated pine. Uh, okay, 140, 45, we've got some nice big 240 by 45 there as well. Um, also got some more studs uh, spread throughout this row as well. Yeah, it's a nice looking stuff there, guys, it really is. Make sure you turn up for this. Um, and again, on the opposite side there, guys, some nice long length treated there also. All right, so over here is where we start proceedings off tomorrow. Lot number one there. We an unreserved lot. It's a pallet of retaining wall uh, corner brackets there. So you get your uh, probably your two inch sleepers in uh, in those ones there. Uh, lot two through to lot nine. Have a look at how nice and clean this timber is. All right, so we've got uh, eight packs there of 9045 termite treated merch pine there. Three point sixes there. Uh, so that's pretty much where we start off tomorrow, guys. So some nice looking stuff there to start off with. All right. Inside we go. Uh, weatherboard shorts uh, in Tassie Oak on the right-hand side there. On the left-hand side, we've got some Export Grade uh, Tassie Oak in a 150 by 16, also a 125 by 16 there as well. As you can see, lots of timber inside the shed here. It is loaded up even right up the middle there this week. We're swinging over the right hand side here. Have a look at some of this carry decking that came in in the 135 by 20. Half a dozen packs of that we've got there, starting at lot 301. Not bad looking stuff, that nice colour. 
Uh, in behind there, more of the Tassie Oaks uh, export grade, 125 and also 150 by 16 there. A uh, pack or two of weatherboards. Over this side, we've got more decking. Uh, we've got some laminated spotter gun beams and posts. Also got some jarrow decking there as well. Um, there's a nice pack of uh, Queensland mixed hardwood. Uh, we'll just hook straight across here while we're here. Uh, something we haven't had for quite some time. We've got two packs here of shiplap spotter gum cladding. Lot 749 and 750. Uh, 125 by 19. So two packs of the shiplap cladding in tomorrow, guys. Uh, then we've got a heap more new stock here. We've got black butt uh, cover grade overlay flooring in 85 by 14. We've got six packs of the 130 by 14 spotter gum stain grade flooring, guys. Six packs of it. How good is that? Um, then we've got uh, black butt uh, overlay flooring in the cover grade uh, and also some cover grade spotter gum as with the 130 by 14 also. Uh, so all this stuff here, all, all new stock guys, some really, really good gear. Uh, all the way down that road there guys, we've got Tassie Oak, we've got spotted gum, we've got Queensland mixed harbour flooring, all sorts of stuff down there, all listed in the catalogue. Got a heap of doors to clear this week as well, got some real big ones over here. Uh, 620, 21 and 22 if you're after a uh, large door. Nice and uh, heavy solid doors here guys. Some nice looking entrance doors. All this overlay flooring came in this morning as well. Queensland mixed hardwood. We've got a heap of the spotted gum. One of the most popular ones that we sell here in the 125 by 14. We've got some open packs over there if you want to have a bit of a gander of it. Alright, so the 125 by 14. A good load of that came in this morning. All right, uh, over here we've got some uh, polycarbonate roofing. So there's 30 sheets there, they're 2.8 metres long. Uh, that'll, be, that'll be sold unreserved, guys. That one is lot 410. Uh, lot 409 is a uh, massive door there, guys. That one there is 2205 by uh, 1825, I think it is. And that is about 140 kilos, that particular door. Up the top here, lot 411, we've got two massive doors. Uh, they are 50 mil thick, 2620 by, I think it's 1105, and there's 250 kilos, 125 kilos each door, guys. They are absolutely insanely heavy, so if you need a big solid door, maybe even use it for a workbench or something, um, they'll be unreserved as well. All right, so there's uh, some select grade pine here. Uh, select grade Tazioke in a 42 by 19 in the shorts. Uh, there's pallets or oh, packs of uh, engineered flooring. Uh, pallets of doors to clear. There's a whole heap of individual doors to sell as well, just to clear. Um, Tazioke shorts. Uh, more doors along here. 45, 446. 446, so just got a slight little bit of damage on that one. I think our old Forky might have been here. Uh, that one there, lot 446. Uh, more shorts, there's uh, overlay floorings and stuff through here. Uh, lots more doors through there. Uh, we'll make our, just sneak our way through here. It's a nice sort of barn style looking internal feature door there, lot 496. Uh, some more nice uh, doors along here, all to be cleared. We've got the, uh, the Chevron uh, engineered flooring here. Got quite a few pallets of that. Got some half light, uh, clear glazed half light doors. Uh, spotted gun posts. Have a look at this one, lot 549. Pick of the doors this week. Have a look at that one. Lead light glazed entrance door. What an absolute perler. Uh, some uh, vertical uh, obscure glazed doors there. More entrance doors along here, guys. And like I said, all the doors are uh, unreserved. They're here to be cleared. Making our way through here. Pack of Vicash floor and hidden in the middle there. Lot 655. A bit more uh, flooring here. There's some tallow wood stain grade stuff there in a 180 by 14. So what a fantastic uh, uh, auction we have here for you tomorrow. Don't forget, there's also home renovators and carpets as well. Thanks for watching. See you here tomorrow at 10 a.m.